morning. Back on trail. Um, yeah, we got into Leadville the day before yesterday. I got my melanzana and uh, yeah, then we kind of split up everybody. People <laughs> wanted to do different things, I guess. So I'm out here alone now. <clears throat> Yesterday, yeah, we were supposed to go back on track, uh, back on the trail. Um, but that's when we kind of decided that, yeah, we're gonna do our own things. Um, so me and Patches went back to the trailhead and just camped there. So we basically had a zero day doing nothing. Um, and this morning he decided that he didn't really feel like hiking right now. So he's going to Denver or something, take off a few days. Uh, I kind of feel the same, to be honest. It's so weird having been through all kinds of cool situations with people and then it just, it just ends. That's how trail is. So can't really do anything about it. Uh, yeah, I'm here alone now hiking in this beautiful scenery. I have a hot day ahead of me. Yeah, uh, in a few miles, I have a 3000 feet ascent <laughs> over six miles, I guess it is five, five, six, seven miles. So that's going to be a, that's going to be a steep one. And then if I manage, my plan is to get to Copper Mountain Resort uh, this evening. It's about 23 miles, just camp on the trail somewhere and in the morning could go in get some breakfast uh, if the restaurants are open and then head back out on trail so my initial plan well i resupplied for breckenridge that's two days of hiking oh day and a half whatever it, just get in get out back on trail and then i don't really know um <laughs> everything is so new right now been in a group whoa been in a group uh, making decisions with other people and now I have to make my own decisions <laughs> just like in everyday life but yeah I have no one to tell me that's a stupid idea or that's a good idea or how about doing this and that and have you thought about <sighs> now there's going to be consequences <laughs> But yeah, it's yesterday was a weird day and today is probably going to be a weird day as well. Um, yeah, that's how it is. They were cool people. So I am going to miss them for sure. Let's see if we can get through this and maybe find somebody else or someone, some other people to hike with that's what i wanted to say uh yeah or just go solo i did that on the pct uh, most of oregon was basically a solo trip but it's so nice to get to camp and just be around people um, we'll see it's gonna take a little <laughs> a little bit of adjustments but uh, we'll make it and Never quit on a bad day. That's rule number two, I think. Or rule number one, I don't know. <laughs> I will, uh, I will hike on.
I made it up that 3,000 foot climb. Uh, it, it sounded way worse than it actually was. Um, it was very gradual, um, which I wouldn't have expected, but lots of switchbacks and only a few straight up climbs. Uh, so not too bad. And the thunderstorm is over there where I'm looking. <laughs> you can see it's over there and it's going the correct direction, which is away from me. So that is, that is nice. Woo. Oh, I, and I did check my God who got before I decided to say that I was over the top because sometimes <laughs> you get up and you think, oh, wow, I'm at the top. And then you walk past a corner and then there's another freaking hill. Not in this case, though. It's going to be a lot of downhill from here. Uh, I think I saw that on the Godhook app. Uh, I have about 11 miles to go, then I will be near the Copper Mountain Resort, where I will go get some pizza, and then I will find a secret place to camp in the morning. I will, yeah, what will I do? I don't know yet. I just got a message from Mr. Freeze that she saw patches in town, which he said he would do, so that's not a surprise. Uh, and we figured, that we could we could hike on together. Um, so I think it's gonna be me, Mr. Freeze, and Ducky uh, are gonna hike on uh, at least for a while because I know that Ducky already did the Great Basin. Um, so oh, there's a a white gray pika. <laughs> I know that Doggy already did the uh, the Great Basin, so she's whoa, not gonna do that. So when she gets there, she's gonna flip up and start where she she left off. But until then, did I say something about downhill from now on? Jesus Christ! Tiny Pika. I made it to Copper Mountain <clears throat> Ski Resort. That is a freaking big resort. Wow. <laughs> Shit. Oh, thought I had a mosquito on me. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a big one. <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah. It is five minutes to three, so I guess I did pretty good. That's 33 miles. 23, sorry. Uh, yeah. I am going to the pizza slash tap room to get a pizza and also um, kick back and kite uh, down there. Maybe a last goodbye or <laughs> whatever. <laughs> now I'm gonna meet them down there and then we'll. Jesus Christ, it's big. Wow. Way bigger than I imagined. Because we went through some um, ski resorts on the PCT. But I don't believe they were this big, though. 